learning curve that comes from younger players establishing themselves at big clubs, Jamie. Uh, it's as they manage to keep it goalless and all square as we head into tonight's League Cup semi-final second leg. Uh, leads by example, for me, he would be the captain of Arsenal all day long and every Been, Jamie, with the development of Ben over the course of this season. It took him time, I've got to be honest. There's also three changes for the visitors from the first leg. Quivin Kelleher. And of course, it's a point I'm labouring to you, Jamie, with no Salah and no Mane. Oh, I don't see where Arsenal are going to win the ball back. Mm -hmm. And that's the problem. But when I'm in Liverpool, away goals don't count, so there could be extra time and penalties. And of course, this is the second leg here at the Emirates to talk you through all of the action with the place in Wembley. Thomas Party is back after Garner's Afcon exit. He landed at mid a goal in this cup. Must wait for his chance from the bench. So just over 10 miles away around the North Circular, Wembley stands silent tonight. Well, that's an interesting little battle, isn't it? Over on that left-hand side. Bulldozing his way through and Kellen on in the contest. And they're starting on the front foot here. Bakayo Saka hits the deck outside the box and he gets the free kick in a promising position for Arsenal. Well, that all started with some sloppy play by Joel Matic there giving the ball away and they have looked a bit uncertain in these opening minutes it's like his ex and it comes back off the crossbar with being Kelleher may have got a touch on it but Arsenal almost cashing in on this positive start they've made and now Tierney having to Martinelli Martinelli gets to it Lacazette waiting in the middle the referee has pulled it back for a free kick to Liverpool Jones finds Diogo Jota Robertson, it's an outswing out and it's touched in, but the flag has gone up. Fabinho is waiting and then Joel Matip getting to it, the flag's gone up, VAR will check. Yeah, I think Matip seemed to know, didn't he, as soon as he put the ball in the net. Looked to crop. Is that giving chase to that? Matip looking to gain Arsenal here tonight. Liverpool looking to move up the gears here. Diogo Jota away from Tommy Asu. It's Diogo Jota. He never lets Liverpool down. And Liverpool plant their flag in the ground on Arsenal soil. They have the edge. Arsenal have been hit. Well, you were talking about nutmegs. He's done Tommy Asu there. Ducking inside, shot a beat in the right back far too easily. Look at Alexander Arnold, he's middle of the park, setting things up. But looking rusty, isn't he? There, Tommy Asu. This is a miss hit, but it's enough to do the job. Maybe that's what uh, Lomax is Ramsdale, but it's a dagger to the heart for Arsenal, who've been the better side in this first 20 minutes. But they have got so much quality going forward, Liverpool and Jota. That. Doesn't go where Ramsdale think it's going. Probably didn't go where Jota intended either. But I don't care about that. Martin Odegaard. Lacazette's got to stay on side. Saka's definitely on side. Bukayo Saka. Good. <laughs> Laconga collected it just, but his clearance has been blocked by Kay Gordon, brought down by Jordan Henderson. Waiting for Alexander-Arnold to arrive, here he is. A jabbed cross, Jota's good in the air. And Tommy Asu's ball over the top. And Saka had Martinelli now running it. Joel Matip, Alexander-Arnold in his wake. Odegaard. Another good looking ball, Alexander Arnold. Was that a replay as well? This one used to replay, have a final replay as well. Well, they clever footwork, very much like to, to shift the ball between feet a lot of the time and get it. And at the break, it's Arsenal nil, Liverpool one. It's the club of Peter Robinson, the former chief executive, was hugely influential in Liverpool's run. They lead at the break by a goal to nil on them in the summer but Liverpool wanted them to stay and be the number two and he's had to react this 
Lacazette and Martinelli both in the middle here. Bakayo Saka has got Erdegaard for company. Erdegaard, Smith Rowe. There's Martinelli. Tierney's on the outside. Martinelli has to question. And Firmino couldn't get to Laconga. And this is Lacazette who fires over the top. Well, it's a snatched effort. And his body shape was telling you that it was always going to go over the bar, this. A really good ball into him to give White the slip. He's done just that. Here is Jota Firmino in the middle. And also Kay Gordon. And the 17-year-old fires over the top. A big, big chance for Liverpool. <laughs> he probably won't get a better chance than this, and he'll be thinking about this tonight, but... What about this for Diogo Jota? It's most private of training grounds, Liverpool's old base in the heart of the city. The referee has pulled it back for a free kick to the visitors. Yeah, he has struggled, Tommy Asu. He's been brilliant. Does that stay down? The referee was happy with what he saw. He's uh, slowly got back to his feet now. Van Dijk's in the middle here. Ramsdale gets a punch on it and sends it spinning behind. Yeah, punch on Tini as well. Whipped in as an outswing around the head, it hits the post of Kanate, and Henderson kept out by Ramsdale. Liverpool so close to scoring from another set piece, the flag has gone up. Arsenal looking to change the picture here. Erdegaard picking out Bakayo Saka. Three in the middle here for Arsenal. Saka with the cross towards that far post. Make this corner kick. Martinelli with it, right on top of Kelleher. And it drops it. Emil Smith Rowe, who couldn't keep it down. Well, it's not an easy one. I'm just continued his run. Liverpool closing in again for the arrival of Thomas Partey. In the meantime, Martinelli tries to corner with his left foot. And he's dealt with by Kelleher. Yeah, he little time. Mm, I think Ketty have gone offside. Alexander Arnold with that ball forward, and Ramsdale was beaten to it by Diogo Jota, but the flag is up, and that will end those Liverpool celebrations for now. Well, he's just snuck behind Ben White. Just wonder whether Gabriel on this near side is keeping him on. Might be a tight one, this. Might just be leaning into an offside position, but it might need the old lines out there. Fine finish, wonderful finish. Oh, well, that suggests he's onside. Is that Martin Atkinson gives the... It was such a tight one, but he was onside just, and he makes the very most of it. What about that? The chest control takes Ben White out of it, and that... Deft flick completely does for Ramsdale. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, no, I can't look. No, I can't look! This could end his career! Signature move! Oh my goodness! Oh, someone's gotta stop him! Oh, yes! Oh, we know what's coming! He's setting up his opponent! Oh! Boop-a-loop-a-loop-a!